Hey guys, it's me Destiny here and welcome to Fashion Forward Fridays. This is kind of going to be a little bit of a new take on my outfit of the day. We're going to use a little bit of me talking and then a little bit of me modeling, showing you what I'm wearing, where I got it from, and maybe a different way or two that you can wear this outfit. Okay, so I want to go ahead and jump right into my first outfit. And the majority of this outfit is actually from Zara, and I will have all information about the items and where you can find them in the bottom box. The first item I want to go ahead and start with is this shirt. I really, really love this shirt. It's a long sleeve shirt, button down detail on the shoulders as well as down the front of the shirt. It has beautiful colors in it, blue, greens, orange, rust, and even a little bit of pink. It's a great shirt for fall, and it's really, really a great piece for your wardrobe because you can go with just about anything that you pair it with. The next item is definitely one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe because they're very unique. They have a beautiful coloring and they are conversation starters. I always get, where did you get those from? Or what are they called? And they're actually really, really popular right now. They're actually called harem pants. Or you can call them hammer pants. No matter what you call them, I love them. A lot of people don't like them because they think they make you look bigger, but I think they can be very flattering. They can make your legs look longer. And when you put your legs together, it looks like a really full, pretty skirt. Also got these from Zara. These are my olive green harem pants. Next, I want to talk about the shoes that I chose to wear with this outfit. I actually ended up wearing flats because I was going to do a lot of walking and I didn't want my feet to be tired. But originally, I had decided to wear my um, suede kind of taupe colored peep toe pumps. But I thought that that might be a little impractical seeing as how I would have to use a lot of public transportation. Either one of the shoes looked great with the outfit. And it just goes to show you that with a change of a pair of shoes, Kind of change your whole feel of your outfit. Next I want to talk about accessories. Now I have three obvious accessories. I have earrings, I have my septum, and I have my nose ring. But another big accessory with today's outfit was color. The color of my turban, the color of my eyeshadow, my lips, my nails, the jewels in my ring, and then all the colors that played together very well in my outfit. I used the neutrals to kind of go against the jewel tones and to kind of really blend very well with some of the cooler tone blues that I have going on from my nails to the jewel in my ring to my eyeshadows. I really, really love color. As you guys already know, I'm not afraid of color. I love it. I think it makes you look vibrant and alive and youthful and just beautiful and attractive. And for the face of the day, as usual, I have on Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Plus in number 86. For my highlight, I have Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Plus in number 84. On my eyes, I have Aqua Paradise all over the lid. And then in the crease and on the bottom lash line, I have Indigo Impact, also from CoverGirl. On my cheeks, I have NARS Exhibit A with a little bit of bronzer from Wet n Wild in Princess. And then on my lips, I have CoverGirl Outlast Lip Stain in number 430. It's kind of a corally color, but it's really showing up kind of pink on screen, but it's more of a coral color. Okay guys, so that is it for your Fashion Forward Friday. I hope you enjoy this new format that I'm trying out. If so, let me know in the bottom bar. As always, thank you so much for watching, commenting, rating, and subscribing. I'll be in touch and hopefully you'll do the same. Bye guys.